Well folks, welcome back to Spiral Reignited Trilogy. Welcome to the Super Bonus Round. So we already spoke to Bianca last time. But this is our uh, end game content. I need to make sure I try and catch this guy. Apparently. I don't know where is he? Really? Well, that wasn't too dumb. Oh my god. Check out that gem card then. Yay! Okay, so I assume that was it. Just needed to catch that guy. And of course there's something up here. Ah, sheep saucer. Amongst other things, of course. So basically what we've got to do here... See, there's another one here. We've got to chase these guys around. Because they all have a... Uh, they all have these chests full of gems that I need to collect <clears throat> because there's certain doors here that require a set amount of gems to enter. For example, this one requires, this is 20,000. Can't see what that one is over there, but let's go have a look. So I don't really remember this, I'm not going to lie, that's the 16,000 door. So as soon as I've got 16,000 gems. Quite a few gems came out of there as well. As soon as I've got 16,000 gems, I can treat myself to a new level, I believe. Just get a tiny bit closer. Um, I believe the purpose of this is just a little bit of fun. There's an 18,500 door. Yeah, because it's just it's just all in the name of fun. Just some extra things to do after you finish the game, and really, I didn't I didn't want to spoil it too much, but uh, it's like a, a final boss fight as such. Can you make up your mind as to where you're going? I don't think he knows. I don't even think I know. He's just going to run in a circle like this. Hey, this is my tactic. Get off. Um, so you've got most of the gems in here, I believe, it be behind these doors are like little challenges, or levels. Um, they will also provide you with gems. So I've got to get this one over here, and then I've unlocked a door there. Sparks is showing me that there's something over this way. Oh, he's uh, Sparks. What are you showing me? The sheep. Okay, the sheep. Well, I don't know how to get them yet, so... What's through here? Aha! Hi, Spyro. Did you see Bianca? She was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. <laughs> it was pretty funny. She tries to play it cool, but she was scared stiff until you came back safe. I just finished fixing up an old submarine. Why don't you try taking it for a spin? Want to take my sub for a spin? Uh, yeah, Great. sure. Hop aboard. Obviously, there's going to be some things for me to defeat here. Right. Yes, of course there is. Ah, oh, I missed. You have to lock on properly. It's a nightmare. Oh, my God. Come back here, Rhinox. I suppose you could say they're like mini games. Very difficult mini games, is it? Like that. Oh yeah, okay, you get a lot of gems for destroying these. So that's the point. Oh, come on. I can tell these things are going to be awkward. I didn't want this level to be, uh, this level. Uh, duh. I, I didn't want this episode to be too long, really, but I'm thinking it's going to kind of have to be. Where are you going? Stop hiding from me. Ugh, I can't just target. I can't. You have to chase them down. Gotcha. Uh, 
They are uh, slightly awkward in their pathing, I'm not going to lie. Is that... that's perhaps where I came from, isn't it? Doesn't, I don't think there's actually anything else to find down here, just the subs to catch. I got you now. No! I actually don't think there is anything else to find down here. I think that's it. I think once you've... I think once you've done that in there, that's it, you're done. It's only like a, a miniature challenge. I'd love to know how to get those sheep sources out of the way with. So here's the next one. Check it out. This is the world's fastest turbo snowboard course. The local champions are the Sasquatch Six, a gang of yetis on souped-up snow discs. I bet that you could outrace the lot of them. If you win, we'll get a huge pile of treasure. If you lose, I'll have to slick down the whole course with my tongue. So, oh, ready God. to race? So if I lose, you get punished? I mean, that's fine. Right on! Just don't lose, or my tongue's gonna be a popsicle. Right, okay. There's a lot of gems on the course. Uh, can't remember how to play. I can't remember how to do racing. Uh, what was the button to do tricks again? <laughs> Somebody help me, please. Oh, Square's boost. Okay, Square's not to do tricks. Control yourself. I honestly can't remember what the button was. And of course I'm so far behind at this point. Well, I think collecting the gems is also important because... There seems to be quite a few dotted around on the track and I'm going to have to collect them all. We need 100% completion. What was his problem? Oh, I got stuck. I can't remember the bonus to tricks, I honestly can't. I thought it was like the L1R1 buttons. Or maybe you can't do tricks on the snowboard. Perhaps you can. I wonder if that's the case. If that is the case, it's very unfortunate. It also means it's going to be a very difficult race to win. Hey! Oh my god, really? I didn't realise they could do that. Uh, there's gems to collect. Please, game. Sorry, I have to be quiet, but I just absolutely have to concentrate. There we go, that's what I needed. Because there's gems up here. Oh my god, that was dangerous. Oh, okay. 
This is it. This, this is the run. Just, just be careful. That's all I can say. Oh god, I'm so worried. Big flip. There we go. That's what we needed. This actually hasn't taken too many attempts. I'm not gonna lie. In all fairness, yes, I may have cut out most of them. I don't want this episode to be. <gasps> no! No, 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 no. Go, Spyro, go. Go, man, go. Go, Spiral. Oh, thank goodness. I bailed, I bailed, like, I, yes! and I still won. You schooled them like a bunch of frostbitten, flat-footed, molasses-eating, lead-pants-wearing, cross-eyed glacier trolls riding slabs of plywood with sandpaper on the bottom. And we want some shiny stuff, too. Wow, Hunter, really? Oh, <laughs> really? Can't move. Can't move because I'm being bombarded with gems. <laughs> yes, yeah, so sorry I cut out most of that race. It took a couple of attempts of practice. Uh, to be honest, it was quite nightmarish <laughs> and I struggled quite a bit to start with. So I believe the next one <clears throat> is over here. I still don't know how to get rid of the sheep sources. Ah, that's how. This is what you're gonna give me? Right, okay, so be it. Is it infinite? I believe it is an infinite power up. Oh, that would have been a good shot if I'd have got that. Well, you get a lot of gems from them guys, to say the least. Then <laughs> all you need to do is like get right on top of them to drop the fireball. Oh my god, gem bombardment. I say I missed. I was gonna say, how did I miss? Right, three more of them. Hello, there you are. Two more. Duh. Here, you evil sheep saucer. Where did the last one go? Where is he? You cannot escape me. Okay, so the power up's not in infinite, but it's very long. So I've got all 5,000 gems here. That's it, 20,000. Which means the final door is opened. I don't know how she did it, Spyro, but the sorceress must have survived that last battle. She's been waiting here all this time, saving up her magic to destroy you. Well, she's not been waiting very long, because preemptively I completed the game, so... Your best chance at defeating her is my flying saucer. I've cast some spells to give it extra firepower and unlimited flying time. The rest is up to you. You've come this far, Spyro. I know you can beat her. Of course we can beat her. It's not going to be too difficult now, is it? Come on. I just need to be really careful because I can't exactly remember what happens. Okay, there we go. Yeah, you have to make sure you dodge her attacks. This was the final boss we were waiting for. Oh, that was close. Whoa. Read your targets. Remember what you were taught in flying schools, Spyro. Spyro. 
she's not very accurate, I'm not gonna lie. Then again, neither am I. Come on, couple more hits. She's moving fast. She's not even hit me once. Come on, sorceress, what's going on? Yin Yang. Hey, it's twins. Well, in all honesty, what else can I say? This might be the last time I play this game for a while. <laughs> We're done. And I said it last episode, year and a half in the making, it took me a long time. Obviously, work and stuff didn't make it easy, and neither did my lack of motivation at the best of times. But overall, I've really enjoyed making this series. And for, your, for those of you that have actually made it to the end of this, really, thank you. You must have had some serious patience to put up with me. But um, I hope you've enjoyed it. This is a great platformer, regardless of whether you enjoyed the original games or not. If you enjoyed the original games, then you sort of know what you're in for. But even if you'd never played this sort of game before, it's definitely worth picking up. Because it's fun, it's long, and there's a lot to do in it, really. Especially if you are playing all three. But I think, overall, it's definitely worth the time. And I got this as... I got this game as a birthday gift. And, to be honest, I knew I would finish it eventually. But I think the fact that I've been recording it has actually pushed me to finish it a bit sooner than I probably would have. Let's face it, if I hadn't have been trying to record it, it probably wouldn't have been finishing until 2025. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I honestly don't know. But really, I haven't really got much more to say um, other than really thanks for sticking around to, uh, to watch all this on the channel. You know, I really appreciate it and I look forward to whatever may be coming next. I know this was quite a bit of a long series to start with for like my first ever project, but it's done now. That's it. We're finished. Absolutely everything is all done. And uh, on that note, folks, Spyro's going to say bye-bye. Sparks is just having his uh, snack before we go. Um, yeah. That's it. Game's done. I th don't think I've missed anything. complete. Just like Spiral's existence. Well, until Enter the Dragonfly comes out remastered, but I'm probably still not going to play that because it was a bit rubbish. <laughs> right, guys. Thank you. I'll see you for whatever comes next. Bye-bye.